Hey guys, I am Mr. Kramer Follow to more channel. And before I start this, I'm going to give a shout out to uh, uh, an individual. You may know him. Uh, he's a yet again on my channel. You know, we squashed our little beef that we had earlier. Uh, Nighty Night uh, K. Uh, Night with Nighty with a K and Night with an N. Um, uh, shout out goes to you, dude. And thank you, man, for uh, apologizing like you did and all that. But let's get into this fucking shit right now. WWE spawned a piece of shit pay per view about a couple of weeks ago, about a couple of days ago, actually, called Roadblock. Let me talk. Let me talk to you about WWE and their gimmick bull pay-per-views. <sighs> WWE has been doing gimmick bullshit pay-per-views since the creation, since the PG creation, since they turned PG. I'm getting sick and tired of this gimmick bullshit. TLC. Breaking point. Let me see what else. What other fucking stupid gay ass. Money in the bank. Why? See, this is what I loved about the one... WWF was around. There was a paper. I had my very favorite, one of my favorite pay per views in the WWF was called In Your House. Some of you may may have may know of the name. Some of you may know may not. But there's been a lot of In Your House pay per views dating back to the very first one that was from the mid from the uh, from the early nineties. All the way to the final to the final pay-per-view to the final in your house pay-per-view which was backlash and what makes me mad that this is what pisses me off about WWE they make these bullshit they make these bullshit gimmick fucking pay-per-views and they suck case in point roadblock like always, it it it's stupid. You know what Roadblock remind me of? A pay per view called Breakdown. That's what Roadblock reminded me of. It, I don't understand why WWE does the stupidest shit. Why WWE makes these stupid bullshit gimmick pay-per-views? They're dumb. Everything that WWE does is fucking stupid and dumb. And then not only that, let me take you back to another rant that I did a while ago. I did a McMahon. I did a I did a rant about Vince McMahon hating NXT. If NXT would make a paper would make an original pay-per-view. It would blow the WWE right out of the water. Seriously. I'm not into NXT. I don't enjoy it at all. I, But you know what? I respect what they try to do. But Vince decides to shit on that company. Because that company is making more fucking money than he is. That company is bringing in more fans than he is. And a stupid dumb company. It has become fucking retarded and gay. These gimmick ass stupid pay per views, they suck. Vince, when are you gonna learn? When are you gonna learn? At least, this is what I wish would happen. Seriously, this is what I wish would fucking happen with this situation. Bring back in your house. Bring in your house back. 
That's what you should do. That's what you should fucking do. Instead of bringing the, instead of coming up with these stupid idiotic ass pay per views, gimmick idiotic ass pay per views like Roadblock or Money in the Bank or Tear with Letters and Tears. So stupid. McMahon, you're way, you're way in over your head. I could come up with fucking pay-per-views and put the In Your House logo on the fucking bottom. And it would draw fucking money. Seriously. Shit, I've done it. With my, my, uh. I, yeah, I know I'm 20-something years old, but I still play with my, my figures. Yeah, dude, I love playing with my figures. I come up with pay-per-view ideas. You know what I mean? Like, I can come up with anything. I wish WWE would change their shit. Seriously. I wish WWE would change their shit. Would stop be being so stupid and dumb. And start being and start being fucking smart in their head because Roblox ain't making shit. Money in the bank ain't making shit. These stupid gimmick ass pay-per-views suck. The only wrestling pay-per-view that actually even that actually even tries to draw money is WrestleMania. And I know it's gonna suck this year. I loved back in the day. ECW had good pay per views. WCW had good pay per views, but they didn't. They didn't have gimmicks. You know what I mean? WWE now, Money in the Bank, Breaking Point, a fucking gay ass submission pay per view, Hell in a Cell. Really? Stop making stupid fucking gay ass gimmick pay per views. It is dumb. It is stupid. Bring back the pay per views that we love. Shit, if you have to, if you have to, instead of having Hell in a Cell as your October pay per view, call it Bring Back. An old WCW favorite. Bring back Halloween Havoc. But please don't shit on it like you have done with everything else. Come up with original pay-per-views. Not gimmick shit. God damn, man. I could come up with better pay-per-views than WWE. And I have... If any of you were here at my house, I would show you half the shit that I come up with. That's That would draw better fucking money than gay wrestling entertainment could. <sighs> okay. What do you what did you guys think of Roadblock? What do you guys think of these gimmick ass gay fucking pay-per-views? Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Oh my god, man. Let me know what you fucking think about this. WWE, you can lick a dick. Because it is so stupid that you're going to come up with these gimmick ass pay per views. They're not even drawing any money. NXT is better than you. TNA is, well, Sort of better than you. Lucha Underground. If they come up with pay-per-views, they will kick your fucking teeth in. CZW. Just to name a few. That could draw a pay-per-view better than you idiots. But anyway. Let me know what you guys think.
stupid ass piece of shit pay per views that WWE loves to come up with. I'm Mr. Gurner512, and I will see you on the afterlife. Peace. And 99, thank you for apologizing again, dude. I'll catch you later. Peace.